the hottest July on record put a damper on cultural pursuits? Our reporter took a stroll through the German capital to find out. Summer is in full swing here in Berlin. The capital city has seen record high temperatures this season and everyone is looking for ways to cool off. I didn't think anyone would be up for some culture in this weather, but I was wrong. The Frida Kahlo exhibition in Berlin has been a huge hit. More than 150,000 people have visited the show already. Is it any problem for you to, to, to stand here for three hours and, and wait and see culture instead of going to see? No, for us, it's uh, really obvious to come here. It's Frida Kahlo, you know. And it's, it's, she's my favorite, like you can see. <laughs> yeah. It certainly helps that the building is air conditioned. It's a cool 20 degrees. Back outside, the love of arts and culture is all around me. Many people have picked out a special spot in the shade to settle down with a good book. Can I ask what you're reading? Isn't it too hot to read? Not at all. I think the weather is fantastic. I can't get enough of it. I have a day off in this weather, and I have this spot here next to the sparkling water. I'm reading a book called Extremely Loud and Incredibly Close. It's very moving. I've laughed and cried. I can't imagine anything better than sitting right here. Even Berlin's famous subculture scene hasn't slowed down under the blazing sun. I head to Meyer Aquarium in Kreuzberg, where a group of artists are displaying their work in 40 very unusual locations. It's pretty muggy here with all the fish, but artist Christoph Schlingenzief's bizarre animal film makes up for it. The hunger for arts and culture in Berlin knows no temperature boundaries. Here at Gendarmenmarkt, classical music fans gather for the open air festival. <laughs> this is the third or fourth time we've been here. My friend came from Cologne just for this. I told her she had to experience this concert. You only get this in Berlin. The world famous German film orchestra of Babelsberg thrills the audience with classic film hits. The cafes lining the streets are packed with people drinking, laughing and flirting as locals and visitors enjoy the best of Berlin. The street music provides a soundtrack to this summer fun. Nearby, we find another popular hangout, Berlin's oldest beach bar. The music tonight has a Latin flavor, cha-cha and tango. Even I get in on the fun. And in the amphitheater, the audience is getting ready to see one of the greatest love stories of all time, Romeo and Juliet. The play is full of emotion and beauty, a summer spectacle that everyone can enjoy. Finally, the hot, hazy day draws to a close. One thing is clear, nothing can keep Berliners from their beloved arts and culture, not even the heat. <laughs>